Brian, you've done a great job of creating this table for us, and it's really magnificent. It's fresh, it looks like summer, it's a perfect kind of summer bride table, and yet it's so different than the other two, which I loved also. Tell me a little bit about what we've done here. Well, you know what, th this table is all about being traditional and being contemporary at the exact same time, and that's what I really love about it. So for instance, this overlay, the soutache oh, overlay, wow which I think actually is a, a classic old-fashioned pattern. I really, oh, really, really love beautiful. this. Isn't it? Yeah, it has kind of a lighthearted kind of look to it as well. It's really beautiful. Right. It's and, and again, it has great texture and great movement uh -huh. to it that I think is fairly, fairly important. The flowers. Well, the, the flowers, this is a really, you know, really wonderful thing I like to do where it's a collection of flowers. Mm -hmm. So we have three different containers. And, and perhaps on the opposite tables, Bill, we might do high arrangements yeah. so that we create a nice rhythm to the party. So you don't mind having the tables being different? Well, in fact, I, I insist on it. If we think about this like a room in your house or a collection or really making it feel residential, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what's fantastic. Instead of just looking across the room and seeing all of the same thing. Mm -hmm. And it really gives you a lot of different things to look at. So if you go into the candlelight, we have our low frosted votas, and then we have this, these very simple um, glass votas with the floating candle, which I actually really believe adds a little whimsy to the yes. table. And then again, the flowers with the tulips, and look at these beautiful irises, mm, these gorgeous. custard colored calla lilies that are sort of yeah. flowing over the side. I just yes. think, I love that feeling. That has, that's what gives me that opulence, is those, the calla lilies flowing like that. Now the plates are unusual. They also have a nice traditional underpinning. They do, but also I think they're really fresh. I just love this pattern. And then once again, we have the, the really sort of traditional hemstitch napkin, yes. which I always stick by. And then look at this great little surprise. It's a little favor. That. Isn't it? You know, I love the sheen to it. And we have a beautiful picture here of Courtney and Robert. That and it's a nice so little surprise. That was so custom and thoughtful. A uh, wonderful mm -hmm. little book tied closed with pages inside. That is fantastic. Now, what have you got here? This is well, looks like you know, a, I love this. This is yeah. really edgy. I think it's modern and young. And it's an MP3 player. And I think we all should know how to use them. Yeah, right. But yeah. <laughs> at the end of the day, put three great songs on them and songs from the wedding. Your dance, you oh, know, with Courtney nice. could be on there. I like a little that. Beatles music for Robert. That's that's I think a great surprise. Perfect. Then we come down to the blue box. Well, Doesn't look, get any better than that. This is very selfish. I'm always, you know, I'm thinking the favor is always driven for the ladies, but yeah. this is something for everybody. This, this is great. Cool. Silver a plated golf tee from golf Tiffany's. Tea. It's heavy. Isn't it fantastic? It's got the the Atlas uh, little Tiffany thing going on in the a top. Great surprise. Yes, great. And then the little bean necklace for the ladies. Mm, I don't think wonderful. they'll complain about that. Love that. Look at this. This well, is fantastic. Uh, another wow. selfish moment for me. I love sweets and I love yeah. these cookies. They're really classic. And look at this. There's there's many designs we could put on them. Gorgeous. We put their initials on them. You put Courtney and right. Robert's monogram on there. It's so beautiful. And so you can design this any way you want. Any way you yeah. want. You know, it's really fun. Of course, we could pick up the pattern on the tablecloth and put that on oh, the cookies. Nice. You have given me so many ideas. I don't know where to go with this, but they're all fabulous. You are the most creative guy I know, and I really appreciate what you do to create really a moment of luxury in all the parties that you do. Thank you so much. Congratulations.